Hey guys, it's your boy Bowling Kool Aid. Um, I'm here with my first solo commentary. Normally, I like to be, you know, in a group, um, a party chat, so I can talk to people and kind of get a little back and forth going. We'll see how this works out, and then if uh, if I still don't like it, then maybe we won't even come back. But we'll see. Um, today, we'll bring you a little Black Ops 2 gameplay. Uh, we did some hard, or I did some hardcore kill confirmed right here. I've been getting my ass punched in all day playing hardcore domination. Just terrible matches. I mean, winning the matches, but then having like, you know, 21 and 49 or 12 and 32. I mean, it's sick backwards. Like, I was getting six and seven captures, but I just die over and over and over. And I don't, I don't see myself as a tryhard. But I was getting so frustrated and so angry at just feeling like it was just a constant rotation of death that I just said, you know what, screw this. I bailed out, went and played some Minecraft for a while, got my head straight. That's what I like to do. You know, when I start to get upset with the game, instead of just fuming and hating on it, I just bail out for a little bit, play a little Minecraft. Uh, they have a new motocross game, that motocross madness. They came out, it's an Avatar game on the Xbox Live Arcade, which is a great game, man. It got a high review on IGN. I had a blast with it, so I play it a lot. And just clear my head a little bit, get back, you know, and then come back in. And I decided not to do domination this time. I did some kill confirmed and had a pretty good little match. Uh, I'm not great. I'll never, I'll never be a, a, a 60 and 2 player. <laughs> That's just never going to happen. Uh, I don't even think I've gotten even close to getting a nuclear on here. The nuclear emblem or whatever. Just not going to roll like that. Right here. Oh, gosh. I don't really like to camp. But since I was just coming back from my little break from frustration, uh, I was like, you know what? I'm going to sit right here. And when this dude spawns, I'm going to shoot him. And so I sat here for a minute. Just looking at it. Normally... I mean, I did just prestige, so I didn't have EMP grenades yet. I uh, also didn't have my normal setup, as you'll see from the kill streaks. Uh, I, I normally like to ride with uh, UAV, Hunter Killer, and Care Package, because with the Care Package, you kind of you can get anything. And I know people hate that, but I am a four four kill player, so I'll go ahead and take it. But yeah, this dude pissed me off because he destroyed the thing before I could get kill the guy. So. Anyway, it was not a big deal, but I was just like, raw, and then took off back into the game. And here, of course, I forgot I didn't have an EMP grenade and was way too damn far for it to have done any good if I did have it. Um, yeah, so then I get shot right here. But anyway, my point, the thing is, though, you know, like, I love the game. I play the game. I have fun with this game. When I get frustrated with what's going on, most of what I get frustrated about is not the game itself, but the way people play the game frustrates me. Uh, snipers that run around getting quick scopes. I know that's a strategy. I get it. I still hate it when it's happening to me. I laugh my ass off when it's happening to Magic Sausage or Squealing or Q or Verbal Ken or any one of them, man. I'll just I'll laugh because... They'll get so mad, and I'll be like, it's a strategy, guy. It's a strategy. But I, I know I get mad about it, too. I love that. I love destroying a sentry gun as soon as they put it down, especially if it hadn't gotten any kills yet. I think that one got one kill, but, oh, I love destroying them right away. Um, but, yeah, so, anyway, yeah, so I, I hate the way people play. Like, I get mad about the way people play. I don't get mad at the game itself. And I understand that the two... You know, people make the argument, well, you know, if the game didn't let them quick scope, then you wouldn't have to get mad about quick scope. Okay, yeah, I get that. I get that. But the fact is, if I really hated the game, if I was really mad all the time about the game itself, I just wouldn't play. There are plenty of games out there that I really enjoy. You know, the game's already mentioned. I, I love some Minecraft. I love my little Moto X game. I got the, uh, oh gosh, I can't remember the name of it now, but there's a pool game that was on sale last week, and so I play a little pool, and get into that but uh those are mostly just to calm my nerves cuz cuz of people upset me but if i really hated the game like i hate no. battlefield 3 i know there's hundreds of people out there that like battlefield i don't agree i i don't think it's fun um maybe one day you know i'll try battlefield 4 i'll rent it i'll see what it's about but i just don't enjoy it 
I didn't enjoy World at War that much when it was out, when it was the Call of Duty game. I didn't like the tanks. It seemed like everybody made a beeline for the tanks. And it just, I don't know. It just, it wasn't that good. I, I like running around. I like running gunning. Uh, I like a little camping every now and then when I'm frustrated or when I'm just trying to kick back. So, you know, that's, that's, I love this game. And what get, drives me nuts is, is, you know, I play this game every day. I play this game. I play Minecraft. I play some video game of some sort every single day. Uh, I got a wife that loves me. Totally gets that I'm a video game addict. She wants to be writing or reading a book or something. She wants me to leave her the hell alone. You know, when <laughs> she's trying to do her downtime stuff. You know, so once the kids are in bed, she gets out a book or gets their Kindle out. And I jump on the Xbox and we make, you know, and, and everything's cool. So I don't have one of those wives that gets angry because, oh, you want to play video games. You know, I'll sit here and talk to her while we're playing. Throw in a little commentary while she's in bed or, or she'll sit there and get real quiet while I'm talking to my friend, you know, when we're doing our recordings when everybody's in the party together because she doesn't want to accidentally get her voice on here. Uh, she's very shy. I love her to death. Oh. But, uh, yeah, so anyway, <clears throat> I don't I don't get mad about the game, though. That's what I'm trying to get at. And I get so frustrated when I get on, like, Game Facts or Game F you know, it's Game FAQS, but I call it Game Facts. I don't know. Whatever. But, uh, or, or even in parties and people just hating on Call of Duty and they're like, you know, I play it every day, but every day I just hate this game so much. You know what, that's silly. You know, if you're going to hate on this because, oh, you know, they put out a map pack and the maps, you know, it's a reskinned old map. You know what, good. It's a reskinned map that everybody loved. Uh, the last Call of Duty, I loved having Crash back on it again. That's, I love that map. I don't mind. I understand that the, you know, I'm not going to be able to play a Call of Duty 4 map. You know, if, if I'm going to play on a Call of Duty format, somebody's got to make it over. And if they make it over, they need to get paid. That's just the way it is. People don't work for free. I don't come to McDonald's and say, hey, you owe me a free Big Mac because I eat here all the time. That's stupid. You know, and people that think like that are stupid. So, there are aspects of this game. You'll hear me over the next however, many, however long I'm doing this where I'll bitch about aspects of the game. But if I really ever hate a game, you're not going to hear it because you're not going to see me playing it. I'm going to find something else. And people need to do that. Uh, my boy Harry, uh, Magic Sausage, he hates Lord of the Rings. He hates what Peter Jackson's done to that whole series. Like, just frustrates the shit out of him. Every time we talk about it, he rages. But he doesn't go and sit there in the theater and watch it and bitch about it. He just don't watch it. That's smart. That's intelligent. That's what people should do. I'd love for him to see The Hobbit. I'd love to be able to talk to him about some of the things that they did and changes they made and why they made He's not down with that shit. He don't want to hear it. He don't want to have nothing to do with it. It makes a hell of a lot more sense to me than somebody playing Call of Duty every single day and just talking about, oh, this game is sorry. It's just a remake of the last game. You know what? Did you play the last game? Did you like the last game? Then shut the fuck up. You know? I mean, don't don't sit here and bitch because they're giving us more of what we all love doing. And if you don't love it, find something else. Go play something else. Don't sit around and bitch about it. You know? Complain about how people play it. Complain about campers. I think it's kind of funny. Campers, you know where to find them. Go kill them. If they kill you, go back and kill them. If they kill you again, you suck. That's what usually happens to me. Because I suck. I'm terrible. But I have fun with it. And that's what we need to do. If you're playing a game that you have fun with, it doesn't matter. None of that other shit matters. You know, quick scoping, fine. I know how they can fix it. Slow down the... Aim down the sights time for a sniper rifle. Just slow it down a little bit. They can't quick scope then. They'll find some other way. They'll find a workaround. Same way with Minecraft. They change certain things about Minecraft. We find ways to work around it. There's ways to make things that you want. Um, but just sitting around complaining, that's not doing anybody any good. You're hating on people who put a year or a year and a half or two years into of work into it. You don't know. Maybe maybe they saw. Maybe there's some reason that snipers can't slow down their draw time. Or maybe maybe the people that make the game think that that's a valid strategy. Maybe they really do. I mean, I joke about it all the time, but maybe they really do think that's a valid strategy. And if they do, it's never going anywhere. Uh, there's something else in here that's not going anywhere that people bitch about all the time. Shit. There, there's every aspect of this game people complain about. But anyway. I digress. You know. This game matches over. It was fun. 
and we have a lot of fun. So listen, you guys have a good day. Um, once again, this is Bowling Kool-Aid, and I'm out of here.